This video shows you, how to configure your printer using your browser. It is assumed, that the initial printer setup has been done. The advantages of using a browser setup is. You can create an admin password. Set up static IP for your printer. Set up an easy host name. And this configuration will allow easy addition of more printers wirelessly, without going through these steps. First, start your browser, type in your IP address. If you have set up DHCP on your router, you can find it from your router, or make an educated guess based on your starting IP and number of devices on the network. Now you can see, the different options available to configure. Here you can add a password, this can prevent unauthorized change of settings. This is where you can change your SSID, passphrase or security. This is where you can change your IP address, by default it is set to DHCP. You can change it to a static IP by selecting manual. Enter the IP address of your choice, make sure it is in the same subnet mask as your router. I change it to a static IP for easy access using a browser, and a new printer setup. Make sure you write down your IP address. Do not change the rest of the numbers. Here you will see the setup of Bonjour. This is the setup, that makes your printer air print capable, or now you can print wirelessly from your iPad, iPhone or iPod Touch. This name will be visible on your Apple device when you try to print. ePrint setup. This will help you print any document by sending an email to your printer. Enable this option, obtain your printer email and you can print form anywhere on the web. Depending on what your needs are enable or disable this. These are some of the features, that I like configuring through the browser. If you like the video, please don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Thank you and have a great day.